<laughs> Peanut Pudge. Yeah, I think. Welcome back to my channel, guys. It's good to see you. Uh, we finally back home. Finally, we surpassed a lot of things going on back home. And now we have time to edit. And I think I didn't do so much food content lately. I have a lot of great recipes gonna come up. And from now on, new rule. Every single Saturday I will upload one recipe. A keto recipe. This channel particularly is a keto friendly channel fully packed with food, training and also supplements and we have a lot of advices for you. Now, today's recipe well, like I said, it will be some great peanut butter. You can make this very, very easily. You buy the peanut, uh, peanuts, you save because we have a real good peanut butter which will cost a lot, lot less than you will buy it from a store. So, enough talking, let's go. A pound of peanuts, to roast them. Actually, we added to another pan to be two because otherwise it will be too much in one pan and you will burn one of the parts and some will not get a nice even coating. So do that, make sure it's not too thick and you will be perfectly fine. After roasting it just like a little bit to make it a little bit more crispy and more browny, you can see some of them of course are the burn but it's not a problem uh, it takes like five or ten minutes but you need to shake it in the pan to not stick it and not burn all those because when a peanut or an almond or any nut uh, it's burned it has a really really bad taste so don't do that now we have to leave it to cool down like for one hour then we're gonna come back and show you the last step for this peanut butter. Take your machine and now we're gonna have to add our roasted peanuts. Pretty much that's it. Spread it out nice and evenly. Lay it back on. And oh, rookie mistake. Turn the power on. And it's done. 10 minutes of stirring this and it's perfect. It's pretty smooth, I think. Yep, that's the perfect texture. And you cannot find anything more particular better than this one. Because imagine, I purchased this a peanuts, uh, two kilogram, no, two pounds for uh, two and a half bucks and uh, two pounds of peanut butter will cost me uh, 12 bucks plus shipping which is uh, better and this is a homemade version which is mean which means we have a hundred percent accuracy on uh, what you have in here just peanuts nothing else we bleach them, so let's make some toast on it. Because nothing can beat a peanut butter sandwich, and we have here all the low carbs recipes from the previous vlogs. We have the zero carb bread, we have also a version of strawberry jam, uh, it's the same principle as we had on the apricot jam. Uh, yeah. 
Also, we have this homemade peanut butter. Nothing can be more keto friendly and uh, low carb version for this. And it's really, really healthy. Anybody can enjoy this. Now, I think this is worth a thumbnail. So let's do it and then came back to show you how great it tastes. And we have here the peanut butter sandwiches. And let's see. Perfect. Come on, you should really do my recipes, guys. Very simple. Just come on, everybody can do that. No big science on it. Glass of almond milk. Perfect keto. Perfect. Man. Now, I think that's all for today, guys. I hope you enjoy that. And you will make it very soon some homemade peanut butter because why to buy all that crappy things with palm oil on the market or if you go for the uh, organic ones or the healthy ones, you will pay a lot. When you can instead go buy some peanuts, roast them and make it your own. Come on, nothing can beat this. So with all of that, I'm out of here. If you enjoyed this, please let, let me know in the comment section below. Show me some um, feedbacks and give me a thumbs up button. And don't forget to subscribe if you didn't already. With all of that, I'm out of here. So, bye.